Researchers here at the Sinclair Lab within Harvard Medical School tell me this study is the first of its kind to show that epigenetics, which is the way that DNA is organized, can be changed, meaning scientists can now drive and reverse signs of aging. There's a clear way to accelerate aging through uh, disruption of the epigenetic programming in cells. It can then also be restored back to a youthful state. Thomas Dixon McDougall was part of the study that took 13 years. It looked at mice within the same litter. Take a look at your screen. Here are two mice with the same DNA sequence, but as you can see, they don't look the same. One of them has had this artificial aging construct. That mouse is the one that looks older. Then researchers reverse that process. PhD student Chris Petty says by repairing their DNA, they made the mice more youthful. And turning these genes on is sufficient to erase aspects of aging. Petty says the process was harmless, like getting a shot at the doctor. The cells uptake the information, uh, translate that into messages in the form of protein that do all the work to remodel the chromatin into a more youthful state. And both researchers say the mice were overall healthier. Yeah, with this we did see like signs of increased muscle uh, strength and activity. They are now trying to figure out how the discovery could help people. If we can intervene early or even as this study shows later on in the process to reverse the aging, um, it seems like we might be able to have a more broad um, way of impacting many diseases all at once.